welcome to my channel and welcome to today's video. Puffy eyes, dry under eyes, dark circles, and eye bags. Now, what causes all of these issues? There are a number of things that can cause these. If you don't remove your makeup at night, if you don't get enough sleep, if you drink too much alcohol, if there's too much salt in your diet, all of these can contribute to you having dark on the eye circles, puffy eyes, and even eye bags. Now, another main factor is age as you age you will notice that there's like water retention under the eyes and this will make the eyes appear puffy however guess what thank goodness there are so many homemade remedies that you can use to have to control and sometimes to get rid of the dark on the eyes the puffy eyes and the eye bags however you also have to try to find the underlying factors for most people it's from being tired and not getting enough sleep for some people is age however there are other causes so make sure to know what really costs your then if you know what is going on with you and you want to try this remedy then it definitely will help you somehow so if you're interested in this video continue watching. our first ingredient is parsley and take a look this is what the parsley look like if you do not have parsley go ahead and use some cilantro now parsley is loaded with a lot of antioxidants that is great for decreasing the swelling of your eye bags it is also great for getting rid of the dark under eye circles. Parsley have vitamin K which is a wonderful vitamin for the eye area. It decreases swelling, it gets rid of baggy eyes and it also clear up the dark dry under eyes circles. Our next ingredient is carrots and carrots is a great ingredient to use under your eyes whether you're using the carrot juice or you're using the carrot seeds now carrot is loaded with antioxidant carrot also have vitamin k when you apply carrots under your eyes it's gonna help to shrink those eye bags and it will also help to get rid of the wrinkles by boosting the collagen production it will help to shrink the swelling and it will also help to clear up those dark spots so I'm going to be mixing both the carrot and the parsley together for step one. So to begin, the first thing I'm going to do is to prepare the parsley and the carrots. Now the carrots are a little hard, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to add a little bit of a water to the carrots and I'm going to blend. If you do not have a blender, go ahead and grate the carrots. So to the carrot, I'm just going to pour a few tablespoons, probably about three tablespoons of water and I'm going to blend. Now after blending the carrot, we're going to strain. So you need a strainer and this is what the blended carrots look like. So we're just going to pour this in. We're going to strain since we only need the carrot juice. So now that we have our carrot juice ready, we're moving on to preparing our parsley. We're going to need a couple of leaves of the parsley. And this is about good. So I'm just cutting off just a bit of the stem, not a lot. And then I'm going to wash these and I'm going to be blending with a little water also. And since I'm going to be blending, I'm not going to chop it. I'm just going to fold it like this and just place it in the blender. And I'm going to pour about a quarter cup of water in the blender and I'm going to blend. We're going to do the same thing to the parsley. We're going to strain and take a look. So just strain the parsley. So here we have our carrot juice and our parsley. And now we're going to put these two together to create our eye treatment. For storing, I'm going to store mine in a glass jar. Make sure to sterilize your glass jar. Now, I've used water in this recipe. Therefore, you're going to use this up within three to seven days. Make sure to store it in your refrigerator, okay? And I'm going to be using a quarter cup 
or 60 ml. So here we have the carrot juice and quarter cup of our carrot juice. I'm going to use about the same amount of parsley juice, pour it in. I have a little left over, so I'm just going to pour that in. And then I'm going to give it a little stir. And here it is. This is the treatment you're going to use under your under eyes and some cotton pads. However, let me prepare step two and then I'm going to show you how to use both of these for best results. Moving on to step two, and I'm using just two ingredients here. Here I have the carrot butter. And like I was talking about the carrot before, carrots have vitamin A, which is retinol, and this is gonna boost the collagen production. Now it's also gonna help to clear the dark circles. It's gonna shrink that swelling under your eyes. And another wonderful benefit of this for the eye area is that it's gonna get rid of the wrinkles, giving you basically a wonderful look around your eyes because as you know if your eyes has a lot of bags and also swelling and dark circles it tend to age you so the ingredient the vitamin A which is basically retinol in the carrot seed oil is definitely going to boost those collagen production plump up the skin under the eye area clear up those dark spots and just leave you looking younger and the next ingredient is lavender oil and lavender oil is going to work just as well as the carrot seed oil so i'm going to mix these two together to create a wonderful night serum for your dark under eye if you do not have carrot butter go ahead and use the carrot oil you can also choose to mix both they're the same anyway just that one is solid and one is liquid so I'm just going to use a, a teaspoon of the carrot butter. Just trying to get everything out. And for our lavender essential oil, I'm going to add a few drops, probably about 10 drops. If you do not have lavender oil and you have lavender water, go ahead and put some of the lavender water with the carrot and the parsley. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to blend these two together. You do not need a lot of this. A little goes a long way. So just mix the, I'm going to tip a little bit more of my lavender oil in this and this is essential oil you can also choose to have a little almond oil in this and as you can see it's nicely melted and this is what it looks like and now I'm going to put this in a little jar So I personally like to make a fresh batch every two weeks or so. Now if you want to get really creative with this, you can also tip a little bit of a rosehip oil in it. So here we have it. We have step one and we have step two. So once you make step one, you're going to store this in the refrigerator. Before you use step one for the very first time, you can also choose to place it in the refrigerator for it to get really cold. When you use it cold, it is definitely more effective. So I'm going to place this in the refrigerator for a couple of minutes and then I'm going to come back and I'm going to show you how to use both step one and step two for best results. Here we have our step one and this is our carrot and parsley. Now to apply the carrot and parsley, it is best done with cotton pads. You can use cotton pads or anything that you have that is convenient that can actually soak up the treatment. So I'm using two cotton pads, one for each eyes. So you're going to just dip it in and soak it up and then you put it over your eyes. Now if you're not using everything at once pour a little in another container and then you soak these you can also choose to just put cotton pads in a ziplock or probably about six for three treatments pour the solution on it and keep it in your refrigerator so I'm just gonna show you what my under eyes look like to begin take a look 
And now I'm gonna soak my cotton pads. Always make sure to stir because the carrot tend to settle at the bottom. Just soak, don't make a mess. Give it a little squeeze. Don't make it too dry. Make sure it have the solution in it. And here is your cotton pads, totally soaked and cool. Now, so I like to put it over my entire eyes like this. However, if you do not want to treat the upper witch, it's a waste of time not to treat the entire area. So you can also fold this like this and you could place it right under your under eyes like this and you leave it on for 30 minutes. So you could fold it like this. And you're going to take care of just underneath your eyes. For me, I like to do the top, the bottom, the side right here where we tend to get the wrinkles and fine lines. So I like to use big ones, open it, and place it over my eyes like this. And this is really cool and nice with a very pleasant smell. And once I do that, cover the other one. Then I'm just going to press this in for about a minute. Focus on the areas. Just keep pressing press especially the under eyes just press it dab it dab it dab it dab it you're actually allowing the skin to drink this in the pores so keep dabbing dabbing and as i said for about a minute it's like you are waking the eye area up for circulation so you dab it dab it and just play with it. Make sure your eyes are closed. Just dab it. And if you're using a half, you're gonna do the same thing. Just use your fingers and go right under, pata 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 for about a minute or so. You can actually just enjoy yourself with this since you're gonna be sitting with it for 30 minutes anyway. Now, once this is done, you're gonna sit with this for 30 minutes. After 30 minutes, you're then gonna remove the pad. So I'm gonna sit with mine for 30 minutes and then I'm gonna be back. I'm gonna show you the result and then I'm gonna move on to step two. Now it has been 30 minutes and I've been sitting with this. I'm gonna remove them. Remember, once you take these off, you're gonna throw them out. So don't use them two times. Make sure you have enough cotton pad for fresh, application each time you want to use this as often as you wish every night it can be used it's very safe if not two to three times per week for best results so now that that is done you can choose to whoa uh, check this out guys this is awesome i'm telling you this parsley is a no joke rewind and look at my picture just before i apply the treatment and this is what it now look like. Amazing, I always like, ooh, so wonderful. Now once this is done, you're gonna rinse the area off with some cold water, just splash some cold water on and rinse it off. And then you're gonna move on to number two. And you're gonna apply this just the way we applied the pad by taking a little on your finger like this and you're just gonna warm the treatment up, just warm the oil up just warm it up on your fingers and then you're going to press it under the eyes above the eyes i like to press it above my eyes also and i like to put it right here where the wrinkles and fine lines are once this is done you're going to go back with your two fingers the same thing and you're going to just dabba 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 you are massaging around the areas of your eyes powder powder let me show you what i'm doing here Pada, woo! Pada, 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 pada. And then you are good to go. You're not rinsing this off. You're sleeping with this. You can use this both AM and PM for the number one. Use whenever you feel like, whenever you have the time. So there you have it, guys. My wonderful two step system to get rid of eye bags, puffy eyes, dark under eye circle, and your bonus is wrinkles and fine lines. So there you have it. Thank you all for watching. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to share the video and leave your comments. And if this was the first time watching, look below, you're going to see the word subscribe. Just click on it and you will be subscribed. Thank you all and I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.